I want to show you the CPUC map of the Bay Area. The areas in red are the ones that PG&E is really worried about. They cover parts of the North Bay, Peninsula, Santa Cruz County, and also the East Bay. PG&E has sent a letter to customers in these extreme high fire danger zones. It says when winds are high and conditions are ripe, the utility may cut off power temporarily, a preemptive strike to prevent wildfires. 48 hours in advance of us possibly shutting off the power, we will notify customers. And then 24 hours in advance of us possibly shutting off the power, we'll notify customers again. Now, this is one of PG&E's new solutions in the wake of CAL FIRE's finding that the utility is responsible for many of last October's devastating wildfires that killed more than 40 people and destroyed thousands of homes. All right, I'm going to once again show you this map uh, of the power areas that could be shut off. I'll draw your attention to this, the Lawrence Berkeley National Lab. That is in that effective zone. You can see in Cal's Memorial Stadium right there. Uh, that is right on the edge. Of course, they have their own generators, but keep in mind that uh, there are homes in those hills as well. So I'm going to bring you back over here and bring that down for you. And let's talk about the video here of PG&E crews working on the power lines because they feel like this is very important. They tell us they understand that there are implications when they shut down the power. For some people, a real health and safety concern when power goes out. And they promise not to pull the plug lightly.